Hello you guys, and welcome to a brand new episode of Weird vs Weirder. And in this episode I'm going to show you the uh, the strongest team against the um, the weakest team. <laughs> um, quite a bit of a difference there, uh, completely different players. Um, so let's get into it, I'll start off with the strongest team. In goal we have Che Gneo. Uh I just went for one who has um, good chemistry with the other players. And I also went from being quite tall because you can't really um, you can't really see the strength of a goalkeeper. So this guy Che Gneo, things like say it. But anyway, left back we have um, the strongest player of the team, Ella Kobe, 95 pace, absolute monster. Next in we have uh, Ched Ju, I think he's how you say him. Uh, he's, he's also got 90 pace, uh, not 90 pace, 90 strength. Um, the next centre back is Somero. Uh, he has 92 pace, absolute beast there, especially um, for a bronze, that is a lot of strength. And then um, right back we had Wei, Wei Silowski, <laughs> I think that's how you say it. He is the weakest player of the team, he only has 88 strength, but still absolutely amazing for a, um, for a right back. Anyway, on to the centre mid, we have the Inform D Sutter. Uh, he has 91 strength, which makes him pretty hard to uh, push off the ball. Uh, next player we have Vesel Veselinovic, I think, and he has 92 strength as well. And uh, the last centre mid is Pauga. Uh, he also has 92 um, strength, which makes him um, a very good strong uh, central um, midfield and uh, on to the left mid we have Mokulu he has 92 strength this guy is an absolute monster um, I've played with him before he's absolutely beast I've had him in a um, Belgian Pro League team and um, he was pretty much unstoppable on the left and a strike we have Kowali Belly <laughs> yes like I said he looks like a rapist and he has 91 strength uh, we don't want him uh, to pin you down or anything. <laughs> but anyway, on the uh, right wing we have a left wing, and we have uh, this guy Dami. He also has 92, um, 92 strength. Uh, also very good. I had the uh, him and Mokulu in the same team. It was a very good combination. Anyway, let's go on to the weakest team. In goal we have uh, Luciano. He is the smallest uh, goalkeeper that is Brazilian. He is uh, only five foot eight. Uh, on the centre backs we have Marquinhos. He has 55 strength. Uh, next to me, we have Matthews, who has 60 strength. And uh, next to him, we have Perez, who is the strongest player of the team, and he has 70 strength. On to the right mid, we have uh, Rodriguez. He has 34 uh, strength, makes him very, very weak. Uh, next to him, we have Morales, 27 um, strength. He is the weakest player on the game. Uh, if, if, if anyone basically gets anywhere near him, he just falls over. Uh, that's why he is not as good as his stats tell you. Um, then anyway, next thing we have Oscar. He has only twenty nine strength. You can't actually feel that with him to be got honest. I, I, when I played with him, I thought he um, actually thought he uh, felt quite like strong. <laughs> but, um, I don't know. Uh, anyway, left mid we have uh, Juazinho. He has thirty two strength. Uh, and on to the left wing we have uh, Carlos, thirty four strength. Uh, on the right wing we have Eterbe. He has forty strength. We do have ninety pace, which makes it absolutely incredible. And into the striking position, we have Barrientos, or Barrientos, <laughs> um, with 34 strength. So a very, very weak team. Uh, basically, if, defend, if any defender gets anywhere near you, um, he's going to fall over. The centre-back's not so much, um, but it's still very weak for a centre-back. But if you come up against like, uh, someone like Akin Fenwar, or someone like that, um, you'd be fucked, <laughs> is how I'd like to say that. But um, anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. If you did, please do leave it a like. But for now, I'll see you guys next time.